Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Uh, I'm just gonna adjust the camera here a little bit. It's leaning down a bit much. Okay, there we go. So I thought I would do this as a live feed because um, I am starting today a GoFundMe for our friend Hans. If you recall from him from many of our other episodes, he was in uh, the Potter's House series. Uh, he helped out with the general story. He's just a really great guy. Um, last year, Hans was telling me that his house burned down. I guess, thankfully, he wasn't injured, but he went out somewhere, uh, saw a bunch of smoke. Hans could tell the story way better, but uh, he went out, saw a bunch of smoke, ended up being his own house. He went back and his house was gone. So he owns a piece of land out in the country. His house was uh, demolished with the fire. Uh, it did not have insurance is my understanding. So he's been living in a fifth wheel. He's totally fine with that. He's happy with it, but he's got no heat or power in there. Um, so albeit for me to uh, let this go. And I think I mentioned this on a video, maybe like the live feed last night or the day before. And uh, one of you said, why not start a GoFundMe? And so this morning I woke up and I thought, uh, why not? Why not start a GoFundMe? Now Hans, as of this minute, has no idea that, um, that I'm going to do this for him. <laughs> and so I started it up on GoFundMe just minutes ago. Uh, I'm going to be posting the link after this video is done. But essentially, I'm just trying to raise him enough money um, so that he's maybe got some, some money for heat or power over the winter. It's just, it's getting way too cold here, especially in January. Uh, if you saw that Potter's House series, it was like minus 40 Celsius or Fahrenheit. When it gets that cold, it's just cold, really cold. Um, and the thought of him going through winter uh, was not ideal. Now, my mother-in-law has offered, her and her uh, partner have offered to take him in over winter if he can't uh, get heat this go around because we want to make sure he's looked after. So worst case scenario, he's got somewhere to live, but he might want to live in his own place over winter, uh, you know, with his own stuff and surroundings. So um, basically the gist of this right now is um, starting to GoFundMe. If you go to GoFundMe, it should be live right now. It's under Helping Hands because uh, even in a moment like this, I can't help but uh, put a pun in there. <laughs> Hans uh, has not asked for any help. Uh, you guys should know that, he's not asked. In fact, he said he's totally fine, just wrapping up in more blankets. And then he laughed in his very Hans sort of way and said he's fine, don't worry about him. But um, his character is such that A, he wouldn't ask for help, and B, he spent pretty much all of his time this summer helping other people. Um, for either, you know, just for the sake of helping. I, I know he helps a lot of folks out in his area. He doesn't even charge the money. He just feels that if someone needs help, he'll go and help them out. So he's a very uh, caring person, and uh, I feel like maybe it wouldn't be such a bad thing to show a little bit, of, uh, send a little love back to the old Viking. <laughs> so, um, so that's it, basically. If you guys want to help out, that's great. If you uh, if you can't help out, or or maybe this sort of thing uh, isn't up your alley, that's fine. Uh, I'm not trying to, um, you know, Hans isn't asking for money. I'm just saying that if somebody out there wants to help out, they certainly can. Um, and it'd be nice to send them a surprise. So we're going to do our part. We're going to help them out a bit. Um, but I know some other people out there had mentioned that they would like to help them out. And this is sort of a very um, nice organized way of doing that. Uh, so putting up the GoFundMe is a way to respect those people who wanted to help. And, uh, and you know, we can funnel it to the right sources and get it to hands and there's good visibility and there's lots of reasons why you want to do it this way. Uh, but you guys can track and see his progress on the GoFundMe site. So, um, so check it out. Go to GoFundMe this morning um, or share this with your friends. Uh, you'll have to give me a minute to add the link down below because this is all happening basically right now this morning. I'm going to work pretty soon <laughs> and uh, I got to head, head off to work here, but I want to make sure I got this up and running because uh, I look out the window, we had snow yesterday and uh, we're only going to be getting, you know, colder and colder and he's a really nice guy and just wanted to do something. I don't know how long this YouTube thing is going to last. I hope it lasts for a while for me, but um, for those of you out there that care and uh, enjoy the series and Hans' personality, which is 100%. What you see on camera is what you get with Hans. He's a great guy. If you want to help the guy out, go to GoFundMe, send him a buck or two or something. I'm going to leave this up until Christmas time um, so that hopefully by Christmas Day, Hans will have, um, you know, he'll be looked after. So we're going to leave it up. Let's see what we can do. I set a goal of $5,000. I think that should be enough for uh, propane for winter for him. Um, propane can be kind of costly, but I think that should be enough for propane and electricity for, for winter time. I'm going to leave it up though. So if it goes past that, whatever it goes to is all going to go to hands. 
Um, GoFundMe, I think, does take a percentage, but everything else, every little bit is going to go towards hand. So if you guys want to help out, that's fantastic. Check out the GoFundMe page. I hope you all have a fantastic morning. Uh, and hence, if you end up watching this later on, you're going to have to be mad at me later <laughs> if you didn't want the help. Because sometimes you have to accept help um, and, uh, and recognize when uh, there's people out there that care about you too. So I hope you guys have a wonderful morning. Take care. Check out the GoFundMe page. It's listed under Helping Hands. And we'll see you all soon. Bye for now.